Now our motor did our now our motor determine equivalent resistance between A and B. So how can we determine? First of all, check series parallel. Okay. If you see here, if you point, if you consider that is point A, that is also A. This one is also A. This one is also A. This one is also A. Why? Because no voltage drop between these two, these two, and these two. Okay. Means that point, that point, that point, and that point represent same potential. After that, redraw the circuit again. If you, if you redraw the circuit and suppose that that's point C. Okay, now that is A and that is C. 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 resistance connected in parallel. Clear or not? After that, C and B, that is R and A to B so next one okay that is R okay so final combination that is P that is R R R R combination of these four that is R by 4 because of parallel and this one this one is final after that making that is the whole combination of this that is r by 4 and r by 4 plus r that is 5 r by 4 because of both are in series so final combination that is r and that is 5 r by 4 and this point is a and that is point b so r of a b this will be equal to 5 r by 4 into r divided by So we got 5R by 9. This is the final answer. Make it very clear, very simple. Because first of all, check which one is series and which one is parallel. Okay. So this point, this point, this point are same potential. After that, make redraw the circuit like this one. This R, 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 R are parallel. So R by 4 and this R with combination of this one is series so that is 5 R by 4 and this R is corresponding to here so we got 5 R by 9